to get flashlights with you. I need you to stay calm. Tornado warnings. <laughs> Up to 50 people have lost their lives. In I'm not sure if we will ever stop talking about Marshalls. People that are trapped. If you're reading fanfic, call your sister. <laughs> Cassie and I found these matching pajamas. Oh, hi guys. Is she ever gonna shut up? That one. Oh, your booty all is in the camera. <laughs> or should we try eggnog in it? Do not read. Fill it just a little bit with hot water. It is brutal. Well, they just in your same place. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about? Moving east at around 50 miles per hour. I need to get flashlights with you. I need you to stay calm. We are getting indication that um, per Kentucky governor, up to 50 people have lost their lives in Mayfield, Kentucky. To your safe place, no, no you take care of you. So it's hard. like being in the airport. This is um last night's leftovers. My roots are out of control, so I need to figure out when Cassie wants to do my roots, bleach my roots, because they are out of control. But last night we um, had multiple tornado warnings. It was literally like three o'clock in the morning and it went until like five o'clock in the morning, so we were up for like two hours in the middle of the night. I was thinking about all the old people like living by themselves. Oh my gosh, I thought she opened the door fully by herself. I was thinking about all the old people that were like alone or like couldn't get into the basement or something. I don't know, we were like calling our neighbors, making sure that they were okay. The little neighbor kids that always come over, they live at their grandpa's and he has a, a storm shelter. So they were in there and they were all like all good to go. But I was thinking about all the old people that are by themselves because when uh, Cassie and Max still lived in our hometown, there was a tornado and they had to like drive over to my grandparents house and then help them down into the cellar and there's literally no like my grandpa has a leg that's amputated so he, he has like one prosthetic leg and i don't know like my grandma couldn't have helped him into the shelter by himself like he would have fallen down into the shelter and that just freaks me out and i just get nervous for all the old people out there and i was praying for everyone last night lots of people died last night it was really sad like scary so I'm grateful to still be here. <laughs> okay, let's get a workout in so that I can shower because I feel so gross. Speaking of siblings, if you haven't heard Ryan's song by Ash, maybe don't listen to it. It is brutal. I mean, all of her songs are brutal, but that one, oh! Ryan, good job. She always did just in the middle, Manini. I feel like my roots have reached the point that I need to do this hairstyle in order to not have so much root showing when I am doing my curled hair. I just feel like I'm seeing way too much brown. If you're looking for a Christmas present for your mom, your grandma, your sister, I am obsessed with this. This is the Hot Tools Signature Series one and it's, it was kind of expensive. Cassie has one. Cassie, what brand is yours? Hot Tools? But then they also sell some at Marshalls for literally like $25 and I think this one was $70 at Walmart. That one photo of The Rock has ruined everyone who wants to wear necklaces and a turtleneck. I feel like this looks very retro. The necklace, yes or no, is like too masculine. Love it. Uncle. I swear my entire head just took me like 
two and a half minutes if you don't wash your hair every day the easiest thing ever smooths all the frizzy and like if you have yeah, any random just... kinks like from a ponytail you literally use this for two seconds and it completely fixes your hair and it looks like yeah. you just gotta blow out oh are neither of these toasted coconuts open wait do you want to try the pecan caramel in it or should we try eggnog in it i mean oat nog <laughs> Uh, these wine bottles in here are gonna be the death of me. <laughs> Still leftover matcha in here, by the way. Is she ever gonna drink it? Are Probably she not. ever gonna stop talking? Stop asking about Stop talking to me! Is she ever gonna shut up? Do you want iced or hot? I'm not a fan of hot matcha, TBH. It's not the same. Okay, I'll take you through my matcha prep or my matcha. It's not a recipe. How I make my matcha. First, I get a glass cup. Fill it just a little bit with hot water. The chocolate on the gram. The chocolate on the gram. I do like a heaping fourth of a teaspoon. And then sometimes I do an extra half heaping in each. Mix it all around. I don't know if there's a way, like a possible way to mix up matcha to where it doesn't settle at the bottom eventually. Every time I see someone drinking it out of a plastic cup, there's always like chunks at the bottom. So I just think there's no way around it. Sometimes I'll put honey in it, maple syrup. You can use stevia or like a coffee creamer. And then I literally just put like a dash. This is oat nog, so we'll see how this tastes. And then I'm gonna use this Califia almond milk. It's the unsweetened vanilla, but we love the toasted coconut kind. We also love just pure coconut milk in it. That's also really good. Stir it on up again, and then... I'm gonna have almond butter and blueberry and banana toast. I didn't end up eating that smoothie because I really was just craving this, and so I'm having breakfast for lunch. We always dump out like half or like three-fourths of the oil that sits at the top of the almond butter because it's just so much and it always separates and it's so annoying to try and like work it in. So we save the oil and we use it to cook what? What do you use it to cook? Um, Asian dishes. So I paused for lunch, ate lunch, and watched Avatar with Mac and Cassie. Came back, looked at Final Cut Pro, and it was like, changes cannot be saved. So I restarted my computer. I'm opening it back up, and we'll see if my entire day's worth of editing is gone. Okay, I think it's <gasps> praise. Oh my god, my stomach was hurting so bad. I was literally praying. So dramatic, but the worst. Okay, we're good. I'm not sure if we will ever stop talking about Marshalls while it's the holidays at least, but Cassie and I found these matching pajamas. We found literally four. There were only four left, I think, literally total, right? Four. For Audrey, Cassie, me, and my mom. We used How to do matching pajamas, like multiple years in a row, we did matching Christmas pajamas, and then we missed like the last two years. Because we haven't really been together. Years with matching pajamas is way better. These are my, actually, no, they're not. I the Cassie. Both of them. I was gonna say these are my favorite. The way that Cassie did it is The cuter. blue stripe is so cute, you know? Okay, can, can you scoot over? Yes. Yeah, you're fully in it, like oh, way, way, well, way, way, way. I can't, all I can see is this arm. Look at you, you're more in it than I am. Oh, hi guys. Another high five, we'll do a trans, a TikTok transition, ready? Ready? I'm gonna hit this. No, do it again. Wait, 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 I'm not even in the mirror. Okay, go ahead. They're like pillowy. Yeah, very pillowy. Honestly, how are you kidding? I thought I was okay, gonna but I will myself say this. and I literally can't seem like to know it. I'll say this, pan back. What does that mean? Oh, flip to the mirror again. <laughs> this gift nice. set is $25 and you get the three pieces. So, and they have pockets, I think. Oh no, that was the other ones that have pockets. Oh, well, you don't need these pockets. Don't. But, but this is, okay, I will actually wear these and a lot of these sets with shorts I can't wear because they have short sleeve and I cannot do yes. a short sleeve, but I can do shorts because I'm like in the covers, but I need my arms Long. covered or else I will freeze. If you are in a stressful situation right now in your life, do not read Serpent. <laughs> it will wreck your life. I just can't. It's so, the tension is so high. Hopefully I can get back into the spirit. The season of the witch. And so she told the person in the book? Like she told another character or what? Okay, ready? 
<laughs> There's something haunting about a body touched by magic. Oh, okay, hold on. So let's see. Because sometimes they don't translate for you. You guys heard it here first. Audrey has convinced me to start Serpent and Dove. You've done your job, baby sister. See how my glasses are off? Because this is the glasses off. This is the glasses off. Rub your eyes. Close the book. Pause for a second. Break the break. You just gotta press, press the nose, rub your temples a little bit. And then call your sister. You're in a cult, call your dad. If you're reading fanfic, call your sister. <laughs> Brain needs to be fed. It's parched. It needs some good enemies to lovers. The last Y fic book I finished. Well, I started two since then, but I haven't finished them because you keep giving me new mother freaking books. I wouldn't give you new books if you finished the old. The last three, four, four books I read were adult, nonfiction. <laughs> the box in the woods was the last one I technically finished. I started Suicide Notes by Beautiful Girls. It's so good, but then you were like, read the cruel, pr cruel prince. So I started Cruel Prince, and then you were like, look, here's a Christmas short story book. So I've been reading the short stories. All right, guys, look at my makeup. I took three naps today, as you can tell, probably with my swollen face. A little tired from the tornadoes last night. But I also had like a freaking almost migraine today, which I never have. Anyway, no creasing on my eyelids, and I put it through it today. So, perfect. Hey guys, look at my makeup. I took Good girl, that was a good one. Anyone else's dog just like to always be upside down? I'm ready to announce the giveaway when you are. Your booty all is in the camera. <laughs> All right, getting ready to pick the winner for the Versace perfume, the gold necklace, and the sunglasses. For this one, you had to share our sibling advice reel to your story and then put your own sibling advice on that story as well. So congratulations. I'm actually impressed with how many of you um, like entered and all of you guys had really, really good advice. So Yeah, I love reading it. This one was probably my favorite. For sure, me too. I loved reading everyone's yeah. advice. I think we need to do like a sibling story time one next time. Oh, that'll be fun. Yeah. All right, drum roll, please. <laughs> Can I hear this to you? Go good. One, two, three, two. She was there for the whole time. You should become running into you, nutty.